Yo, what's good, YouTube? I'm gonna show you guys how to lower your input delay on console, PS4 specifically, because I don't know how to do it on Xbox. If you guys want to edit like this, just watch the whole video. Alright, so when you're at devices, Go to external keyboard. Then when you're on an external keyboard, you want to go down to key repeat delay and key repeat rate. Put the delay to short and put the rate to fast. That will lower your input lag a lot. Here's another trick for a mouse delay. I see you guys going to pointer speed and putting it to fast and slow. Just keep it on normal. I have a trick for you guys. Here on screen is a pulling rate of a mouse. The lower it is, the faster it's going to be, and the higher it is, it's going to be smoother and slower. You guys are probably really confused because you can't change your pulling rate on the PlayStation. You have to change it through your laptop if your mouse has a downloadable software, so keep that in mind. The secret behind 125 pulling rate is that there's no mouse acceleration. Here on screen is the Model O software. I personally use this mouse, so I'm going to show you the program. If you look on the bottom right, you can see pulling rate, and once you click on that, it should show you what I showed you uh, last screenshot of the 125, 500, and 1000 pulling rate. When it comes down to peripherals, you might want to have a Razer keyboard, Apex Pro, or a Ducky One Two Mini. If you have some crappy old keyboard, that delay is going to be a lot worse than what it is.